Hello viewers, I have started a series named PUBG series. So in this series, I will be teaching you how to create a game like PUBG in PC using Unity engine. So first of all, you need to download any Unity version. I will recommend the latest version because it's more good. So subscribe my channel and turn on the notification icon to get the latest video updates. So first create the new Unity project. And yeah, you have this latest version as it will not work because I hope you get the latest version. So create the new button to create the project. So without wasting time, you have to create a new project. Then select the 3D because I'm using 3D. In URP and HDRP, you might lose your project materials for some reason. That's why I didn't use them. So you have to name your project. This is 3D, this is HDRP that I was talking about. So you will get good graphics in HDRP and good performance in URP. And But I prefer 3D. You have a mobile 2D and mobile 3D template also. So name your project and create. Hello guys, welcome back and our project is open now so this is our inspector panel here in the left and this is our hierarchy where we manage objects this is console where we get debug and error this is animation panel where you can animate if you don't have go to windows animation and select animation you will get it so in package manager we can install the film package but leave it for now this is our C project window where we can import files and uh, add drag them there then we get it in the scene view so create a right click right click in the hierarchy create 3d object cube and you will get this cube there so let me turn on lights and see this there is our uh, cube so this is our game view and so if we delete it it will be moved from the game view not only the game view it will not be in the scene view also so if you delete anything from hierarchy it will be removed so create 3d object cube and reset the transform to 0, 0, 0. that's the dead middle that center what we say okay so select the pan tool and see you can pan so where's this pan tool press q to select it or it's in the this corner i will take it okay so press w for this tool this is a move tool you can select it from here and uh, you can also press e for rotate tool or just click there so r for this scale tool and i pressed q for pan tool see how fast it is w e then r for the scale tool then t for the 2d tool then y for all tools and you will get every other tool so this is custom tool don't use it and uh, yeah one more thing this is move tool you can move on x y z every axis so reset it and you can change the transforms from here like rotation scale so make it x20 y20 and 0 0.01 on the y axis so you can see we got a floor yeah. so it's that easy to create a floor so now just rename it to floor right click 3d object and again create a cube because i like cube we set the transform to the dash center now just move it a bit up and go to the scale tool what I'm doing is just designing a pillar so it's that easy I just make it long on the y-axis ctrl D to duplicate and arrange it in every corner press ctrl to enable snaps ctrl hold ctrl and then move see it's snapping or lagging whatever okay so now I have four pillars in my game yeah so our PUBG tutorial is going to be more and more awesome again. So let's duplicate the floor and rename it to roof. And just go to the move tool and set the y axis. Let, let me rename it. Uh, sorry. Okay, duplicate. Let's again. So duplicate, name it roof, and here you get it. Yeah. We have four pillars. I turned off the lightning. Okay, nothing more. So if I go to the game view, you will have the lightning. This is just scene toggle, okay? 
yeah so don't mind it so now we have four pillars and one roof and one floor one camera and one sun yeah some directional light sorry so everything's done till that and I, I don't know why my camera is dancing yeah it's dancing so we have this for today in the uh, uh, you wait let me rename them so pillar one pillar two then pillar three then pillar four so yeah in the next video i'll be importing some paid assets but don't worry don't worry wait wait i will give you the paid assets in free yeah i will give you them in free if you follow these this tutorial you will get many free assets i'm just managing the hierarchy you should do the same but yeah so if i hide them you cannot see them in both neither in the hierarchy neither in the i mean neither in the scene view neither in the game view so stay connected stay tuned for the next episode of this pubg series pubg like game series yeah so in the next episode we will be importing some assets they will be paid assets but i will give you them in free so the link will be in the description so without wasting time thank you for watching